Today, I'll be setting dangerous criminals free into the world. This might cause a lot of problems. What is going on, TFG Squad? My name is Brandon, and welcome to Be The Judge. So this is the game where I get to decide if dangerous criminals get to roam free or they have to go back to jail. Hi, I'm Justin. Welcome to Be The Judge. Extraordinary cases are awaiting. Let's see our first case. Oh, so I get to watch what happened. Oh, no. Oh, the guy ran a red light? He ran a red light, but why? Let's find out. Okay, so now I need to investigate why this guy ran a red light? I don't know, maybe he has to go to the bathroom. This doesn't seem like a dangerous criminal. This just seems like a guy that was either in a rush or has bad eyesight. You can use the hint button if the case is too challenging. Let me give you the first one for free. Oh, uh, do I have to use it? No, I'm gonna save my- I'm gonna save my hint for later. Alright, so there's someone in the back. Oh, his wife's pregnant! His wife's pregnant! Okay, it says, hmm, looks like there's a pregnant woman in the car. Let's judge the driver. Okay, I'm letting this guy free. I'm letting this guy free. Uh, here you will decide on the driver's fate. Uh, let him free, send him to- Uh-oh. Did I accidentally send him to jail? No, I didn't mean to send him to jail! I didn't do it on purpose, I was just trying to click through all of the options. Oh, gosh. This guy was rushing to the hospital because he, him and his wife are about to have a baby, and I sent him to jail. Oh, gosh. All right, we are moving on to level two. It says, why did he cut his hair like that? Oh, no. Oh, that is one terrible haircut. Although, once again, not really a dangerous criminal. It's just a, a, a guy cutting hair that wasn't paying attention. All right, uh, let's see. Is there something more sinister going on? What's he looking at? I'm trying to look around the screen right now to see if there's anything... Oh, I can move around. Oh, there was a lady outside and my guy wasn't paying attention. Okay, so I would also get distracted by her. Thank you. Thank you, nice lady in the jury. That's very helpful. Okay, I could either... Wait, what is this? So what are my choices here? I could either have the guy cut his hair back as punishment, I could have his barber shop shut down, or I can fine him a lot of money? You know what? An eye for an eye, a, a hair follicle for a hair follicle, let's shave that guy's head! Yeah! Oh, everybody in the jury agreed with me. Oh, I feel bad for him now. All right, moving on to level three. It's called the Smelly Elevator. Why did they pass out? Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh! All right, I thought the guy eating the hot dog was gonna be the one that made the other people pass out because maybe he farted. I don't know, maybe the lady farted. The lady farted! The lady farted and passed out the two guys! Judging her. Yeah, we're sending her to jail. Should we send her to jail? Uh, wait, or we give her like a... Wait, what? So we can either send this lady to jail. Keep in mind, again, she farted in an elevator. A very minor offense. Uh, she can either go to jail, we can wrap her in plastic wrap, or we can give her a giant gas relief pill. Okay, um, we're sending her to jail. Yep, we are sending that lady to jail so she can leave everybody alone and elevators from now on. All right, the next one's called the modified car. Oh. Oh, okay. Now the crimes are starting to become worse and worse. I think every level the crime is going to become more and more serious and the criminal is going to become more and more dangerous. By the way, if you guys want to see more fun mobile games like this, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel right now. Now, all right, here we go. So basically, she is uh, scratching the paint off of his car. She's keying his car. Looks like she's using a nail. And let's see. So why is she doing it? She looks happy. The guy's, I don't know. Can I move over? Can I see more of the picture? Oh, oh, what, what was that? What was that? If I hold it there, what's going on? Uh, I love you, dad. Okay, no, 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 no. If they're trying to make me feel bad, like, oh, she's just writing a love letter to her dad. 
No, no. Y you can write a love letter to your dad on a piece of paper. You can buy him a, a card at the grocery store, right? Um, no, you're not gonna scratch I love you dad into the side of his car. Th it's a very nice phrase, but you just cost the man a thousand dollars because now he needs to get his car repainted. No, no. I'm sending this girl to jail. I'm sending this girl to jail. So I could either... What? Okay, these are weird punishments. I could either tickle her on her feet with a feather. I could either scratch her car and say, I love you too. Or I can leave her stranded in a haunted forest. Yeah, we're gonna scratch her car back. Wait, is she... Wait, how does she even drive? She was like 10 years old. Was that like a car bed? It looked like a car bed. All right, I don't even know if I'm doing a good job or not. Oh, look at the top of the screen. You can see if I'm e either being a good judge or a bad judge. So far, I'm actually not that bad. I'm heading more towards the uh, saint and the angel category as opposed to the devil category. All right, the next one's called cake face. What did the boy, pro oh my gosh, ow. He just threw a cake in that guy's face. Now, I don't know if that guy deserved it or not. He might be a bad man. This guy might have deserved it. World news. Ah, see? See? You gotta do your research. This man just approved the deforestation of a park. Is that the guy? Why would we send the kid to jail? Oh, I see. We could either send the kid to jail for throwing the pie on the guy's face. We can... What's the money option? What is the money option? Or we can give him a cake as an apology? Can we not send the deforestation guy to jail? I, I want the other guy to go to jail, not the kid. I just want to select the money because I don't know what happens. I got 20. Okay, I don't I don't really know what the money option did, but we did it. Let's move on to hospital room. Why did he cut the, oh my gosh. Oh. My guy! My guy just committed a crime by cutting the cord! Wait, wait, wait. There was something over here. I'm not a very good detective. It, it's pretty obvious. Oh, man. Ah! Okay. So it was the doctor that was the committing the crime here. They had him hooked up to some poison, and he cut the cord and actually saved his life. It looks like he was saving the man. I have no idea what's going on. I'm gonna pick the one in the middle. As a thank you for saving that man's uh, life, we're gonna send him to Hawaii on a lovely vacation. Yep, that's gonna be the one. Next level, it's called prankish students. What is that? Oh no. Oh no. Why did they make the teacher fall? It's March 31st. I feel like it's gonna have something to do with the date. Oh, it was April 1st? No, 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 I'm not gonna allow that. April 1st, I don't know, you can do small pranks like, hey, there's a spider on your face. I, I don't know, that, that wasn't really much of a prank, but you can pull a small prank. You can't make your old teacher slip on a banana and land right on his butt. The man could have just broken his butt, right? My man could have just shattered his butt and, and he's going to be in a wheelchair for the next three months. No, I'm not going to allow that. I'm not going to allow that. Uh, we're sending them to the uh, haunted forest. Yep. We're sending them to the haunted forest for that mean and unwelcomed prank uh, against their teacher's butt. Runway. What is this one? <laughs> oh my gosh! Ow! Oh! We just... Wow! Okay, that was the most dangerous and serious crime we've seen so far. What's in the guy's... Oh. Man, they keep having me go. They keep making me uh, flip-flop here. I just thought this flight attendant was the, the world's most evil criminal. And then I saw that the guy had uh, dynamite in his bag and was trying to blow it up. So, oh man, this is tough. This is tough. I don't know whether to give the lady an award or throw her in jail. We could throw her in jail. We could let her out of prison. We can run her over with the airplane. Okay, I don't know how we're going to get her in midair and then throw her out of the plane and hit her with it. But that's a, that's a story for another day. Hmm. This is tough. I don't really want to send her to jail if the guy was going to, like, blow up the plane. This lady in the jury says she needs a raise. Yeah, I kind of agree with that. I kind of agree with that. Although... Instead of throwing the guy into the plane's engine, she could have just, like, 
called the, you know, the uh, security. You know what? Y you can't push a man into a plane engine, okay? Especially because he was outside of the plane anyway. Call the security guards. Send that man to jail. We don't have to throw him into an engine. I'm putting her in jail. Oh, they didn't agree with me. The jury did not like my decision there. Unhappy customer. Why did the customer pay the check? Or why didn't the customer pay the check? Oh! 150 bucks, she literally threw the, the, whatever her drink is in the waiter's face. What does the receipt say? Oh, there was a bug in her food! Ew! Uh, I could either cover her in bugs, I could give her a free food check, or I could give her money. I'm gonna give her one free food check. She didn't have to throw the, you know, the, the water in the waiter's face. She could have just told him, excuse me, sir, there is literally a live insect crawling on my, on my food right now. Can I get a free meal? That, that would have been more reasonable. Yeah, let's do that. It looks like we have a special level here. We've got a special level here. It's called the Reaper. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my. Oh! Why did the Reaper take his life? Oh my goodness. Okay. Hey, Reaper, you better have a good explanation for this. You better have a good explanation for this. Oh. What? So the Reaper was using his scythe to farm hay for the local farm, and the guy threw trash at his head. I mean, I don't know if that uh, constitutes him dying, but he does deserve to get in trouble for littering. Okay, uh, we could either... What? We could continue farming. We can... Get... I don't even know what these options are. I don't... Oh, maybe the guy will give him a new scythe as an apology? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that, and the jury seemed to agree with my decision. We've got John Wick, or sorry, sorry, Tom Nick. Okay, we've got a special case with Tom Nick. Yeah, let's give it a shot. Accusation, murdering 420 people at a party. I only do what has to be done. Don't you feel bad about the party last night? Like, killing people? I'm gonna ask him if he feels bad. I do. The party was terrible. Don't waste my time. Show me the evidence. Okay, we've got the firearms and we've got the bloody tie. Let's go with the bloody tie. Ha ha! Everyone knows that I only wear black ties. Oh, yeah, that's a good call. That's a good call. I went there to have fun. I didn't hurt anyone. Wait, maybe the bloody tie was the guy you killed, not your tie? I think I was just beat by John Wick. Check out my other YouTube channel. It's called TFG Vlogs, and I will see all of you in the next video.